Couldn't leave well enough alone, huh? You just had to follow me all the way out here. How many times do I have to kill you? Eddie. Whoa, Eddie. It's, it's me. Oh. Uh. Hi, James. Eddie. What are you doing? What's it look like I'm doing? You fat, disgusting piece of shit! You make me sick! You gonna cry, fat ass? You gonna run to your mama? Waste of skin, why don't you just kill yourself? Oh. Maybe he was right. Maybe I am. Nothing but a fat, disgusting piece of shit. But you know what? It doesn't matter if you smart, dumb, ugly, pretty, it's all the same once you're dead! And a corpse can't laugh! Eddie. What's that? You want to talk down to me some more? Tell me to relax? You're just like the rest of them, James. No, I don't want Shut up! You think I'm stupid. You think I don't see it. But you've been laughing at me all along. Ever since we first met. But you ain't laughing now, are you? <clears throat> you need help, Eddie. Don't get all holy on me, James. This town called you too. Yeah, you and me, we're the same. We're not like other people, don't you know that? Well, you're about to find out. Do you know what it does to you, James? When you're hated, picked on, spit on? Just because of the way you look? Yeah, I ran away after I killed that dog. But you know what? It was fun! It tried to chew its own guts up. Finally died all curled up in a ball. Then he came after me. I shot him too, right in the leg. He cried more than the dog. <laughs> Now it's your turn, James! <laughs> Come on, James, don't be shy. Come on, James, don't be shy. Come on, James, don't be 
Did I scare you? Yeah, you did. I guess I deserved it, huh? The fart face that I am. Maybe. Then again, maybe you're not so bad. Just... annoying. Uh-huh. So... <clears throat> you got any other things planned? I think I saw a dark room back there you could lock me up in. Mm, no. I think you've had enough. For now. Well, that's reassuring. Besides, I need your help finding Mary. She's here, isn't she? Come on, tell me. I wish I knew. But she said it in her letter. Wait. So there really is a letter? Oh, yeah. Want to read it? Just don't tell Rachel, okay? Who's Rachel? She's our nurse. I, uh, took it from her locker. My dearest Laura, I'm leaving this letter with Rachel to give to you after I'm gone. I'm far away now, in a quiet, beautiful place. Please forgive me for not saying goodbye before I left. Be well, Laura. Don't be too hard on the sisters. And Laura, about James. I know you hate him because you think he isn't nice to me, but please give him a chance. It's true, he can be a little surly sometimes. And he doesn't laugh much, but underneath, he's a really sweet person. I love you, Laura. I love you like my very own daughter. I wish things were different. I wish we could be happy together, like we talked about. Even so, I know you will have a good life. You're a strong, smart, beautiful girl. Happy 8th birthday, Laura. Your friend, Mary. Laura. How old are you? Um, I turned 8 last week. Does that mean... Mary couldn't have died three years ago. Could she really be here? Is this the quiet, beautiful place she was talking about? Me and Mary talked a lot about Silent Hill. She even showed me all her pictures. She really wanted to come back. She also talked a lot about you, you know? She even. What? What is it? Well, there kind of was his other letter. I think the one was for you. The envelope had your name on it. Did you read it? I wanted to. This one time, I almost did. Figured you didn't deserve to have it. But then I thought, Mary wouldn't want me to keep it from you. So I just sort of kept it for you. Here. It's empty. Laura, there's nothing in it. What? But I didn't take it. I swear. Well, where is it then? I... I must have lost it. I gotta find it. Laura!
God damn it. Yeah! <laughs> 